In Ohio folklore, the Loveland Frog also known as the Loveland Frogman or Loveland Lizard is a legendary humanoid frog described as standing roughly 4 feet 1.2 meters, tall allegedly spotted in Loveland, Ohio. In 1972, the Loveland Frog legend gained renewed attention when a Loveland police officer reported to a colleague that he had seen an animal consistent with descriptions of the Frogman. After a reported sighting in 2016, the second officer called a news station to report that he had shot and killed the same creature some weeks after the 1972 incident and had identified it as a large iguana that was missing its tail. University of Cincinnati folklore professor Edgar Slotkin compared the Loveland frog to Paul Bunyan saying that stories about it have been passed down for several decades and that sighting reports seem to come in predictable cycles. In May 2014, the Loveland Frog legend was made into a musical title, Hot Damn. It's the Loveland Frog. According to various legends, the creature was first sighted by a businessman or a traveling salesman driving along an unnamed road late at night in 1955 with some versions of the story specifying the month of May in one story the driver was heading out of the Branch Hill neighborhood when he spotted three figures stood erect on their hind legs along the side of the road each 3 to 4 feet 0.91 to 1.22 meters in height, with leathery skin and frog faces. In other versions of the story, the creatures were spotted under or over a poorly lit bridge, and one held a wand over its head that fired a spray of sparks. On March 3, 1972 at 1 a.m., Loveland police officer Ray Shockey was driving on Riverside Drive near the Totes Boot Factory and the Little Miami River when an unidentified animal scurried across the road in front of his vehicle. The animal was fully illuminated in his vehicle's headlights, and he described it as 3 to 4 feet 0.9 to 1.2 meters, long and about 50 to 75 pounds 25 to 35 kilograms, with leathery skin. He reported spotting the animal crouch like a frog, before it momentarily stood erect to climb over the guardrail and back down towards the river. Two weeks after the incident, a second Loveland police officer, Mark Matthews, reported seeing an unidentified animal crouched along the road in the same vicinity as Shockey's sighting. Matthews shot the animal, recovered the body, and put it in his trunk to show Officer Shockey. According to Matthews, it was a large iguana about 3 or 3.5 feet 0.9 or 1.1 meters long, and he didn't immediately recognize it because it was missing its tail. Matthew speculated the iguana had been someone's pet that either got loose or was released when it grew too large. One according to Matthews, Shockey was shown the dead iguana and confirmed it was the animal he had seen two weeks previously. Matthews recounted the incident to an author of a book about urban legends, but says the author omitted the part that confirmed that the creature was an iguana rather than a frogman. Matthews also recounted the frogman story in 2016 again on WCPO Channel 9. In August 2016, local Cincinnati TV stations reported that a night of fun turned into a chilling tale of horror when two teenagers playing Pokemon Go between Loveland Madeira Road and Lake Isabella claimed to see a giant frog near the lake on August 3 that stood up and walked on its hind legs. It was later revealed to be a local student from Archbishop Moeller High School in a homemade frog costume.